Hey, what's going on, guys? So, I'm gonna show you guys another game I've been playing. I've been playing Rising Stars, and Rising Stars is pretty much kind of like an idle clicker game. Pretty much, you start by starting missions, which you know you just you just start these up. As in the beginning, you don't need any like requirements. I believe you have fans already, and you get certain items and things like that. I believe a lot of you who've watched my Twitch and are into a lot of NFTs, a lot of Splinterlands players play this game on Twitch and maybe YouTube. I haven't really looked at the YouTube streams, but <laughs> they do play these games. And this is a game I believe will do really well in the future, and I am very bullish on it. Mostly because of a lot of new people coming in to the game, and the more people that come in, the more prices the cards go up in value i've been looking at the market and uh i use the nft market to look at prices because it's way easier <laughs> but looking at the prices of some of these cards so i decided to buy 10 packs the reason being is because if some cards are very valuable but also another reason is you're kind of guaranteed a rare card meaning you're guaranteed a card that has some good value as in, Pixie's card is at 15,000 star bits, and other people's cards, like this card, at, at 13. Some cards are less, but the cards that are less in value are still available in the card packs. So if we go to cards, buy packs, you could open them, because we have bought some. You can see that there's some rare cards still available, and some rare cards have sold out. So if we just look at a quick card, uh, let's see a card that's slightly more expensive than 10k. Um, this card, Winston, is he, a, actually he's, a, he's probably more expensive because he's available in different things, but who is this dude? Toad, I believe. The rare card skill is 200, but no fans. It's pretty interesting. But this guy is 15k. This guy's 26k, 29k, 13k. These cards are not available right now in Rising Stars. Each one of these packs costs about 10k. You get three cards in it. You get you're guaranteed a rare, I believe. That's what I was told by another person on a Twitch stream. They decided, you know what, let's buy packs. Because no matter what, the more players there are, the more up in value these cards will go. The more rare these cards are, the more up in value they will go. Obviously, people are not going to buy the more expensive cards unless they're building a collection. But uh, we still have a chance to get some of these legendaries, which would be really cool. we got 10 packs to open. Let's start opening them up before we, run, we make this video too long. Okay, so we got a rare James, 100 fans, 4 luck, 150 skill, 1 mil cash, a luck, and it's first instruments, we haven't really had instruments. Open our next pack. Uh, there we go. There we go. Next pack, we got a rare space delay, and two common, not bad. Actually, I really do need cards in general of everything. Nice. We got garlic. That's a pretty good card. I believe this is a streamer. I'm not too sure. I believe it is, though. And we got... We're doing pretty decent. Obviously, nothing crazy. Renta, I know he's a streamer. We got two boos. Might have be... Might, might have a chance of giving a boo away. Do you want to see if we could give anything away at the end of this video? Hopefully people can enter. Oh nice, we got Drabs. Definitely a streamer. Know him very well. Got another boo. And cheap mic. Nice. Next. These packs take a little bit to load, so I'm just trying to speed up the process. Rachel. Nice. Good amount of fan skill. If you were to get any epics or legendaries, that would be insane. Rare. Ooh, that gets 500 fans though. Not mind that. How much is that card? Turing Couch. Or is it Turing Couch? 
Here it is. Ooh, that car is currently worth nine twenty-nine thousand star bits. Meaning this pack was has almost three times the value of it of what it is. Obviously I think we made more value in other cards, but five hundred fans is crazy good. Th this is probably the most fans I have in the card. Which is nice. Oh I think we have a James already. And another boo. <laughs> yeah, a lot of boos. That's 15 fans though, so. Pretty high in the fan section. Let's see what else we got. Ooh, Groove, another streamer. Nice, we're getting all the streamers in here. Boo again. <laughs> to the boos. And Sasha. I think we have some a couple of Sashas as well. We'll see what car we could give away. I think we're gonna give away a boo for sure. Oh, another Rachel. Nice. Starbuck. Starbuck. Uh, box. And Millie. Starbuck is. Let's look this card up. Star. Starbuck. Oh, 19,000. Another card is pretty good. I don't know if. If we really made all our money back in these cards, obviously, I could do some math. This is an epic card, so it's going to be worth a good amount. I forgot what the other card was. Should we check our collection? Let's check it out. Okay, but I did not refresh anywhere here. Let's do charity headline, because we're going to go to sleep after this. Um. Try to refresh. Okay. Yeah, our cards are updated. If I think we we'll check back over there. So these commons, they're just commons. Commons are not worth too crazy. Except for the ones that are not available right now. Like 77 starbits, 700 starbits, 777. This one as well, seven. Like they're not worth too much, but they do help a little bit when you're first starting the game. So obviously you would recommend getting these when you start the game. Some of these I think that are sold out are a little more expensive. We could look here. It's easier to look here because you get the prices automatically. And we're looking only at star bits. So we could see there's a lot of scrolling. Like this dude's 7k because it's not available. Some of these guys are more expensive because they're not available anymore in packs. But that's why I'm bullish on the game because I feel like eventually the cards we bought now will not be in packs in the future. Meaning that they will go up in value once they sell out. Alone, it's a good idea to buy some cards in general just to hold and even just to play the game, really. Because the higher you progress in the game, the higher you could go. I mean, this game is free to play, so you should play it. Do we? Uh, I think we do have a rare that is doubled. I believe we got a streamer twice. Or did we not get a streamer twice? We got one of these rares twice, I believe. Whatever. I don't remember. I'll look back into the video after. Okay, that's all the cards we have right now. And we can start working towards getting some more cards in the future. And doing some more giveaways. Currently, let's check our instruments. We got this instrument here. And we got a couple of these common instruments. This rare instrument. You look at all the value, and I'll post in the comments once I figure out all the value of all the cards we've gotten. I need to look back into the video and do some stuff, but uh, yeah, we'll look into it. also got a vehicle. The vehicle is really crazy because I have never. Uh, it's the first vehicle I own. It's a rare, but like still pretty good stats. Didn't get any boosters at all, which is okay. Other nothing. Obviously, crafted record. Yeah, we don't have anything in those sections. But yeah, let's look at what we have in our mission section now. Okay. So right now we have two <laughs> two thousand fans. 
and our ego meter is up a lot now because we got a good amount of fans. So we need we need to do some music lessons, but it's fine. We get more luck now, so we're good. We can actually start putting an instrument in. Obviously, you're gonna put the rare one because, of course, it's good, and we could put our car as well. Our touring couch. And I could do that and leave it at that. But yeah, guys, we're running giveaways on on peaked right now. We're gonna run giveaways every single week. Every single Monday, I'll be posting on stream the giveaway and who we win. We'll be randomly selecting someone from the comments slash someone that liked it. I'm not too sure how this thing works. I tested it out a bit. I don't know sure if it goes with the comments or it goes with the likes or it does a combination of both of them. So I would recommend you just do both comment and like it. You don't have to put your IGN. Your IGN is already in here. This is your Hive account. Unless you want it to a different IGN, then you can put your a different IGN in the post or in the comment. But yeah, guys. For now, I'll leave it at that. I'll see you guys in the stream Saturday. Hopefully, we'll be posting this Friday. I'll see you guys Saturday. I'll be doing some Rising Stars giveaways Saturday as well. So hopefully you guys could tune into that. I'll see you guys later. Oh, actually, one more thing. We will be giving out... Um, We will be giving out a Rising Stars card just before I forget. Before I forget, and I say this. We'll be giving out the card we got the most. Which was, where is it, where is it, where is it, boo, we'll be giving out one of these boos, out to someone in the comments, it's 15 fans and 5 skill, you're just out to one of you guys in the, in the comment, in the YouTube video comments, and it's not going to be given out directly, it's going to be given out during the stream on Saturday, so you guys hopefully comment and like the video. For a chance to win this card. It's actually it's actually worth a decent amount of 2k starfits, really? Huh. Okay. <laughs> it was worth a decent amount, but yeah guys. Give one of these away on this video and maybe on stream as well. Who knows? I'll see you guys on the stream Saturday if you guys are gonna catch it. I'll see you guys later for real this time. Thanks for watching guys.